Welcome back everybody. How are we doing? I hope you are doing well. Today I am bringing you a different type of video. It is not a workout. It is what I eat in a day breakfast options. Now I'm not a huge breakfast person, but I do rotate between three breakfast ideas usually. Either a smoothie, overnight oats, or some sort of yogurt and granola bowl. So I'm going to show you what those recipes are. We're going to head to the store first, grab our ingredients, and then we're going to come back here and whip it up. So if you guys are new to the channel, hey, welcome. My name is Lexi. Make sure to give this video a big like as well as subscribe down to my channel so you are notified on when I drop a new video, either being workouts, nutrition videos, or anything under the sun. So let's go. All right, guys, we just pulled up to the store. So I'm gonna throw on my mask. I'll take you in with me, show you a few items that I usually choose. And yeah, let's go. back I got what we needed I'm gonna quickly show you what I ended up getting and then we will get right into our three options so first it's not in one of the recipes but I'm obsessed with coffee iced coffee from Starbucks I decided to get this because why not so iced coffee Bananas. I like to put bananas both in my smoothie and as well in overnight oats, either on top or on my yogurt bowl. So really, I can use these in all three of our recipes today. Oats. Um, I do sometimes get like the, just the bag of oats, but I also really enjoy these and they're quick oats. So. They're not going to take you as much time. You just got to pop water in them, stir them up, and they are done. So instant oats. I like the lightly sweetened apples and cinnamon flavor. I'm pretty picky with my oats, either apple cinnamon or the cinnamon sugar is quite nice. So next, peanut butter. I actually haven't had peanut butter in a really long time. I go through phases of I'm like obsessed with foods and then I just don't eat them. I prefer the crunchy peanut butter, but they only have the smooth. This is the all natural peanut butter by Kraft. We got our yogurt. So I got the Oikos triple zero vanilla Greek yogurt. This one has 30% less sugar. Next is almond milk. Now I'm not a huge dairy person, so if I am adding some sort of milk in my coffees, my overnight oats, or my smoothies, I do prefer an almond milk. I like the Silk Almond Unsweetened Vanilla, and it's 30 calories per serving. Yum. Next, blueberries for toppings. Throw these on the overnight oats or the yogurt bowl. They didn't have any strawberries or raspberries that looked nice. I do prefer having those types of berries and then blueberries as well. So we went with blueberries. Got some grapes. You can also cut those up in your yogurt bowl, keeping them really fresh. And I prefer the green grapes over red. Lastly, we got for our toppings, Love Crunch Granola. I got the peanut butter dark chocolate. So good. And then just organic cashews. Crunch those on top and yeah. So this is all we got. I'm gonna go ahead and roll into our first recipe. So let's make the yogurt bowl because I think that's gonna be the easiest to assemble. Let's go.
All right, guys, this is usually what one of my yogurt bowls would look like. I'd usually add in a few more berries if they are nice, either raspberries or strawberries. So what we have here is 175 grams of the yogurt, 60 grams of blueberries. We have half a banana and then one serving of the granola. So that's 55 grams of the Love Crunch granola. I'm gonna go ahead and throw the total macros for this granola bowl up on the screen. And now we are gonna move on to overnight oats. All right, moving on to our second recipe, we are now going to do overnight oats. Now I love overnight oats because they're really easy to prep the night before and then take to work in the morning. And you don't really have to do anything, you just have to keep it in your fridge and you're good to go. Now for this recipe, I am using steel cut oats because it is overnight instead of the instant oats. If I am making hot oatmeal in the morning, I will use these but because we're letting it soak overnight, we're gonna use these. is going to be a protein smoothie. Now I drink protein smoothies almost every single day. I prefer drinking my protein in a smoothie opposed to just water. That's just personal preference. So we're gonna get into it. Using the One Up Nutrition Iso Protein coffee flavor. Let's begin. One-up nutrition supplements. If you want to save some money, right now you can save 40% with my code, 20% off of the website. So combine my code, you have 40% off your supplements. I use the One-up nutrition ISO protein in coffee flavor. This is my all-time favorite. I am a coffee lover. So anytime I can drink it, get it in my system, I will. Use my code Alexi20 if you want to save some money. And here we go. I also prefer my smoothies really thick, so. All right guys, that is gonna conclude today's video. I hope you enjoy these recipes if you try them. Now I know they are super plain, but that's just because I'm a really picky eater. Now the overnight oats do need to sit for longer, so they don't look too pretty, but listen, take them out of the fridge tomorrow morning. They are gonna fill you up. Our yogurt bowls are nice and fresh. You're getting in carbohydrates, your protein, 
and fat all in one. And then our protein smoothie. You cannot go wrong with it. Really quick way for you to get in your protein if you are counting your macros. All right, guys, that is going to conclude today's video. If you did enjoy it, please give this video a like as well as subscribing down to the channel if you guys are new. Hey, how are ya? If you want to check out my socials, guys, my Instagram, TikTok, SoundCloud, they are going to be all in the description down below for you. So with that, guys, I will see you in the next one. Wherever you are, have a beautiful, wonderful day. See you.